Apple has announced uh, some new technology uh, for its devices, that's iPhones, Macs, uh, Apple Watches, that is designed to identify known images of child sexual abuse taken from the National Center for Missing and Exploited Children. Eventually we got the actual manufacturer. Uh, they say without defeating encryption, uh, which Apple's technology is prized for, that privacy element, they say that they can identify uh, using a digital fingerprint, if you will, any of these known images of child sexual abuse, and that they will then report that uh, to the National Center for Missing and Exploited Children. They will disable the account uh, and go from there. And obviously law enforcement will, will be notified because it's against the law. And the other thing that they're doing, they are going to scan messages for sexually explicit material, and then that material would not be shared with uh, law enforcement, but that would be blurred. And uh, you know, the idea is to protect kids. So there's a third element to this, and that is that Apple says it will um, flag any time a user uses Siri or search. Um, Siri, you probably know, is the voice command um, element of, of, of Apple devices uh, to, to search for, you know, this dangerous um, sexual content, right, uh, child uh, sexual abuse content. Both of these elements are being objected to by a number of cybersecurity security experts and civil liberty organizations like the Center for Democracy and Technology and the Electronic Frontier Foundation. Now, why? Because what they say is with this technology, effectively the encryption for which Apple is touted, it's been a champion of, of privacy, is going to be degraded. Okay. And the other fear is that once the cat is out of the bag here and the technology is available and repressive regimes know about it, countries like China could insist that Apple uh, put these images into the database and match them and that could be used uh, against you know, dissident groups, uh, the Uyghurs, uh, all, all, it, it could basically be used as a political cudgel. 